Grammys 2022, and the award for the most PDA goes to Courtney Kardashian wows in plunging suit as she takes her tongue kissing tour of love with Travis Barker to Grammys red carpet. Courtney Kardashian and her fiance Travis Scott didn't bother to hold back their PDA on Sunday as they shared a passionate kiss at the 2022 Grammy Awards. The 42 year old keeping up with the Kardashians star and the 46 year old Blink 182 drummer complimented each other in black ensembles though Travis stood out in a hot pink satin overcoat. Courtney put on a particularly sizzling display thanks to her black suit, which featured a plunging top and cutouts over her midriff. Courtney and Travis repeated their performance at the Academy Awards a week earlier, when they showed off plenty of tongue on the red carpet. The reality star closed her eyes and showed off a wide smile as she locked lips with Travis, who also seemed to be having a great time. Courtney who hit the red carpet in slim black sunglasses that matched Travis, wore a striking top with a busty plunging neckline and boxy shoulders that was draped over her arms. She paired it with high-waisted black pants with a raised connection to her top over her taut tummy, which revealed crescent-shaped cutouts on her sides. The push founder's slacks reached to the ground, obscuring her heels. She added some extra intrigue to her look by wearing a set of sheer black gloves that reached all the way up her arms. As usual, Courtney kept her raven tresses parted down the middle, and she let separate strands dangling to frame her impeccably made-up face. Travis arrived in a lustrous hot pink satin overcoat, but he quickly removed it to be on the same page as his love. He put aside his usual punk-inspired clothing for the night but not before spicing up his black blazer by ripping off the sleeves to highlight his tattoos. The rocker appeared to be shirtless underneath it. Travis matched his jacket, which had hidden buttons, with classic black trousers and shiny black buckled shoes. He also wore strands of thick silver chains around his neck. Travis isn't nominated this year, and his last Grammy nomination was for 2016's Blink-182 album California which marked the trio's first LP after the departure of co-frontman Tom DeLonge and the addition of Alkaline Trio frontman Matt Skiba. Inside the ceremony, the couple looked just as affectionate while taking their seats together. Courtney put on another performance as she grasped Travis' face and held his mouth open with her hand in a prelude to another kiss. Courtney and Travis are continuing their whirlwind award ceremony appearances after they had all eyes on them at the 2022 Academy Awards last week. The two also caused a stir with their tongue-filled kissing on the red carpet. The invitation marked a milestone for Courtney, as she became the first member of the Kardashian-Jenner clan to attend the Oscars, even though her family members have attended high-profile after parties in the past. Travis was part of the ceremony as he joined the Oscars band, which included all-star performer Sheila E., pianist Robert Glasper and musical director Adam Blackstone. The Daily Show host Trevor Noah is continuing MC duties for this year's Grammys ceremony. This year, composer and musical artist John Batiste surpassed all nominees with an impressive 11 nominations, while Justin Bieber, Doja Cat and H.E.R. have 8 each and Billie Eilish and Olivia Rodrigo tied with 7. Former enemies Taylor Swift and Kanye West are up against each other in one of the biggest categories for Album of the Year, with their respective records Evermore and Donda. The Grammys were initially said to take place on January 31 in Los Angeles, but got pushed due to the rapid spread of the Omicron variant of the coronavirus. Given the uncertainty surrounding the Omicron variant, holding the show on January 31 simply contains too many risks. CBS and the Recording Academy said. Harvey Mason Jr., CEO of the Recording Academy, confirmed later in January that it would be moving to Las Vegas. We are excited to take the Grammys to Las Vegas for the very first time, and to put on a world-class show, he said. From the moment we announced the postponement of the original show date, we have been inundated with heartfelt messages of support and solidarity from the artist community. We are humbled by their generosity and grateful for their unwavering commitment to the Grammy Awards and the Academy's mission.
last week. The two also caused a stir with their tongue-filled kissing on the red carpet. The invitation marked a milestone for Courtney, as she became the first member of the Kardashian-Jenner clan to attend the Oscars, even though her family members have attended high-profile laughter parties in the past. Travis was part of the ceremony, as he joined the Oscars band, which included all-star performer Sheila E., pianist Robert Glasper and musical director Adam Blackstone. The Daily Show host Trevor Noah is continuing MC duties 